Why Video Editing Matters Quality video editing can make videos more professional and engaging. It helps to increase your credibility. You are creating good content and you want to make sure that the production is good as well. It's always quality over quantity. You should learn how to make good video edits and always create good quality videos even if it will take more time. Don't forget the emotional impact that your videos will have on your audience. This will set you apart when they perceive your brand. Build a successful video marketing strategy and grow your business YouTube channel, do that by subscribing and clicking on the bell icon to be notified whenever we publish a new video. Here are some video editing tips and tricks that will help you to know how to make a good YouTube channel. 1. Film a lot of footage. When I was shooting my videos as a talking head, I almost took double the time needed to produce a video. For 5 minutes videos, I usually shoot like 10 to 12 minutes. In one sitting, I shoot a whole video and during the process, I remove parts that are bad or I just messed up. Always leave space between each part of the video where you can place B-rolls or interesting overlays to help create more engaging content. Finally, you will find that you cut out a lot of unnecessary footage and more than expected. 2. Why do directors use clapboards? During the film production process and as the directors say action, you will find someone using the clapboards. Ever wondered what does a clapboard do? It helps to synchronize audio and video easily so they can mark scenes when they're filmed. When you start shooting a video, try clapping in the beginning. Later in the editing process you will find a spike where you can adjust and sync separate audio and video footage together which will help a lot in the video editing process. 3. Use a good microphone. It's a nice idea to use another source for sound and don't rely on the camera's audio. You can use a lavalier microphone for better audio, and you can plug it directly to your smartphone or into the camera. Don't forget to clean up any background noise and remove any awkward silences and pauses. Question, what type of microphone are you using to create videos? Tell us about it in the comments below. 4. Best lighting for professional video recording, video lighting setup. If you don't use enough lighting for your video production this will affect the quality of the finished video. There are a lot of options that can help you to create a professional YouTube video. Simplified lighting can produce excellent results like ring lights, LED lights, softbox lights and umbrella lights. Using the proper lighting should be one of your top priorities during filming while you are learning how to make a good YouTube video. You can search online for YouTube lighting kit or cheap lights for filming to use in your project. 5. Video background tips and YouTube backdrop. To provide the professional look for your YouTube videos, you can use a solid colored background. Distracting background will look less professional. If you will be using a backdrop paper or a bed sheet, make sure to stand away from the backdrop to get rid of shadows. You can use a clean wall to for this too. There are a lot of YouTube backdrop ideas you can come up with. 6. What is the best video editing software for YouTube? There are a lot of options, but you can start with Windows Movie Maker if you are using Windows OS or iMovie for Apple. If you want to take your video editing and production to the next level, you can use more professional video editing software like Adobe Premiere or Final Cut Pro. I have been using Vegas Pro since 2014 for all my video editing projects. It's more user-friendly and easier tool compared to the other professional software. How to improve video editing skills was one of my top priority tasks. 7. Have a video content plan in advance, YouTube content strategy. I usually create 52 weeks of content at the end of each year to have plenty of ideas of videos to be produced in the coming year. I almost finish all my production process and shoot all my videos in the first half of each year so that I have time to think about more quality content for the next year. It would be a good idea if you have the time to shoot like four or more videos in one sitting. It may take about an hour from your time, but if you are consistent with that schedule once or twice per month, you will always have a flow of content ideas for the bad days and when you feel you are not in the mood. 8. Spice up your videos, you can add some things to your videos to help get your message across. Just don't overdo as it will affect the professionalism of your videos. You can add cuts and transitions, overlays like lower thirds, some video effects and finally add music. Please make sure you have the permission and the rights to use any content on your videos to avoid copyright claims and strikes to your channel. 
You can find a lot of free content online like the YouTube audio library, lower third graphics, video transitions effects, free sound effects for video editing and royalty-free background music. The more you film more videos, the more you will learn how to improve the video production process. Don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more videos like this.